Hello friends, I am back today for my index card um, Sunday and this is the calendar I was going to go through for a little while and now I'm in December, it's December 3rd, this is December 2nd to 1st is 2nd and this is December 3rd so I don't know um, I suppose we can use these for this um, index card. So yeah, these are the two I got for this date. So I wonder if I just mix them up. I know it's kind of two different. Well, it's not kind of. It is two different. Um, December holidays, religions, whatever. Uh, we will just do it. We will have fun with it, right guys? We will respect each other and have fun with that one. Let's see here. Um, I want to get something that's close to the nice. I think I'll just use this one. Nice colors and that. And I'm going to use my Mod Podge today, not my Mod Podge, my Decoupage. Right here, my mat. And figure out, I think I'm going to do them up and down again today. So, I got lots of glue on my fingers. So this is what I'm doing today. I'm going to cut these out. I'm going to kind of do something fun here. Put some of this in here and we'll have fun with it. Okay, so here's what I got. Um, I was kind of researching on my phone look, um, different holidays in December, and there's a ton of um, holidays. Just gonna quickly look at this to show you. There is a lot of oh holidays. Just to show you. Come on, come on, phone, cooperate with me. I was just kind of looking this um, and this uh, St. Nicholas Day, um, Feast of Our Lady. Um, I don't know how it's, I'm not good at pronouncing that. Um, go whatever. It's Mexican. The Lady um, St. Lucia Day, Swedish. Go we see. Christmas Day, Three Kings Day. I have no idea what that one is. Boxing Day. I didn't even know that was actual what it meant if it was anything important to boxing day i thought that was like a, a store day made up holiday kwanzaa that's an african holiday oh look at that there's the japanese so and um i don't know why these other ones say um, let's see, and there's just different things here, but anyways, this is a little educational thing, and I hope you guys didn't mind me sharing that. I think that it's only fair to share that. I only have these two on these cards. I'm going to use them. I personally don't celebrate any holiday, so just saying. But it's just fun to use what's here and play with it, and that's what I'm doing as an artist, just playing with it. Where did I put my... Decoupage. Oh, right here, buddy. So I'm going to use this. And then I put the month, I, put, I cut out the month, and we're going to get a little closer. I cut out the month. Um, no, we, we just do like a, a gift, I love you day kind of a thing here in our family, just because, well, just for the kids, really, because everyone else is getting gifts. So I know it sounds like a silly reason, but. We don't have a tree or anything like that. I love the, the Christmas ornaments, so I make them as, like, gazing balls, which was really fun this year. I got to do that, which was, like, because I really loved Christmas balls. I kind of miss that. So, but we just choose not to celebrate any of them. And we just have our own family day. And we kind of do things on New Year's, whatever. Maybe that's a holiday, too, whatever. We don't really, we don't go into the whole store um, buying ordeal so we're not into all that pressure <laughs> well I, I really glued that one down already okay 
that's not where exactly I wanted it. I think I wanted to move him up. I think he's done. Done for dinner here. Well, I did want to move that one up, but we'll just work with it. So these are the two that I have for this day. And I'm going to do a December stamp. December. I do love making Christmas ornaments, I have to say, though. They are pretty. So. And I don't really, we don't really celebrate Halloween either, but just, the Halloween stuff is so cute. So it's just. Whatever. Whatever. That is so pretty. Let's see what else we can add to it. I was. So. With this card, this card's got the background. I think I was cleaning off my stencil and then I rubbed it with a baby wipe on top of like some spray. I was probably testing. So I'm going to stamp out the word love around the border, I think. Just for something different. I'm using the individual stamps that you get at Michael's in the dollar fifty bin. And I might actually use the little dot to separate them. That isn't oh <laughs> this one's kind of the wonky letter one. I'm just gonna use that as a border. I think that's something that is pretty much everywhere in the world at this time of year or any time of year is love. So, yes, sounding mushy, but I'm putting it there just to remind everybody to love each other. No matter who, what you believe, people still need our help or need a lift and spirits and that kind of thing so just love each other and that's it so I'm just doing that and I think I'm going to add a little bit of gold because that's my favorite thing to add after I might ink the edges a bit don't know we'll see I was going to turn it, but so I just go this way. Whatever works. I'm going to do my O right here because I'm going to use that L. And there we go. Doo -doo. And another one or two of these words, and we've got that border done. So that's very. <sighs> Time of seasons to love. Talk to those people you've talked to in ages. Forgive people, all that kind of thing, you know? Can't hold a grudge. Can, but it's not going to be fun. Will it? I'm going to go continue with that. Oh, I'm going to go V. E. Make yourself miserable and sick because you're holding a grudge, right? And I know it's kind of wonky stamping, but it's all fun. Kind of using it as a border, so. And 
I don't, I'm gonna go right over top of this. <laughs> okay. okay, and that's my border. And I like it. I'm gonna use this stamp here just to kind of. I know it's kind of black again, still on top of it, but give it a little bit of a. A little bit of a different look and now I'm just gonna add a little bit of gold I think to it I'm gonna use my finger I'm gonna shake up my gold and I think we're pretty much done with this card I might outline it a bit might outline the um, tree and the dreidel I think it's called I can't remember oh, I can't remember mm. gonna add a little bit of gold to here a little bit on my December so that's just it I'm just using what's on my calendar and that's what came out of it I'm gonna dry this up guys outline a bit of it here with my 2B water soluble graphite I'm just adding a little shading as I did with my last one with one of these okay I've got two of these they're two different um, hardness of uh, graphite but I like I like that you can move it with the water I really like that so Kind of outlining my own little thing here. Just do my own little thing here. Grunging it up a little bit. I like that. Don't know why. Don't know. Just do. And that is my card for today, guys. Bend it back. That's my index card for this week. And that's what came out of the calendar. There's tons of different unexpected, um, interesting things for all the months. And that's what was on it. So I hope you guys like it. We'll see what comes up next week. Not next week, the week after. I do it every other week with Nikki Parr. And I will put a link, I have a link actually that I keep in my um, um, description box of Linky, uh, Linky, <laughs> excuse me, Nikki's um, um, <laughs> YouTube channel. And um, then you can see her cards as well every other week. And she calls them Nick's Picks, and that's her index cards. Um, and this is my pretty scruffy one, but I really like it. I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to crap like a duck. Talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.